And in New York City, demonstrators are protesting what they call the city's disregard and mismanagement of the AIDS crisis. CNN's Jeannie Mose is standing by live at City Hall with the latest. Jeannie? The group organizing this demonstration is called ACT UP, and today members are living up to their, to their uh, name. There have been so far two groups of arrests outside City Hall here. Altogether, there are perhaps 2,000 demonstrators who believe that the uh, city is not doing enough, that no one is doing enough to fight the AIDS epidemic. Originally, the demonstrators uh, talked about trying to get inside City Hall. However, there were uh, barricades all around City Hall, and police uh, ring the uh, area in riot gear. So instead, what the demonstrators have done is uh, civil disobedience by sitting down in the street. Now, uh, in the first case, about 40 demonstrators linked arms. They chanted, we'll never be silent again, and they sat down blocking one of the main ramps to the, uh, actually from the Brooklyn Bridge. Their technique is to go limp, and then they are uh, carried off by the police. They're arrested. They were banging on the paddy wagons as they're driven off, while the rest of the demonstrators who chose not to be arrested are uh, chanting, the whole world is watching. And right now, a second batch of arrests is underway right behind us. Jeannie, how organized is this demonstration? This is a really well-organized demonstration. Everyone who wants to be arrested, and there are approximately 200 or 250 people that volunteered to be arrested, they had to attend uh, six-hour classes where they're informed all about the legal ramifications of getting arrested and the techniques of going limp and not getting hurt if the police bring in their horses and that kind of thing. Also, uh, as far as the media go, uh, there are people who are pointing out to us where the next act of civil disobedience is going to be so that we can get our cameras down there. I mean, the whole point of this is to draw attention to the AIDS crisis, and they're succeeding in doing that with the media today. Thank you very much. Jeannie Moss at City Hall.